we're just going to come in through here. It's a first for the Northwest Territories, a pop-up testing clinic. Here's my number. A one-stop shop to help curb the Territory's syphilis outbreak. We were given a demonstration before it opened to the public. If you compare our rates from 2019, we've at minimum have increased over 200, about 250 percent. We need to look at innovative ways to quickly test, treat and get contacts. The NWT's Chief Public Health Officer is raising the alarm again after declaring a syphilis outbreak in 2019. The numbers keep growing, more than 184 so far this year, including in five cases in newborns passed on from their mothers. Left untreated, syphilis can cause deformed bones, blindness and even death after birth. In adults, rashes, blindness and even dementia. The NWT got early approval from Health Canada to start rapid testing for syphilis and HIV at the same time. With a prick of a finger, results are known within minutes. A game changer, says the Yellowknife Women's Society. They're not expected to go to the hospital, then they have to wait. Um, so everything's done with the rapid testing pretty quickly and there's treatment that can be done right away. It seems like the sexual health education that we have is not cutting it. They say young people should be getting more information. A lot of young people that I talk to aren't even aware of how contagious SEIs can be, the long-term health effects, or even how curable they could be. It takes five minutes to result. And we I think COVID really um, paved the way on us being comfortable with these point-of-care tests. People want to know and get treated because Nobody wants an untreated infection that's actually eating away at their organs. Nearly 90 people got tested in just one day at the pop-up clinic. The Department of Health says that's almost the number they'd expect to see in a whole week. Juanita Taylor, CBC News, Yellowknife.